Hello, Eric Schulteis here with another audio precision quick tip. I'm going to demonstrate using measurement recorder, saving the acquisition signal to a WAV file on the host PC. First, I'll set the signal path for a single balanced analog channel. Next, I click the Add Measurement button, select Measurement Recorder, then click the Add and Close button. Measurement Recorder is a great tool in addition to the ability to save acquisition signals as files on the host PC, it provides all these results and it can be used in open loop test mode. We'll talk more about open loop test mode in a separate audio precision quick tip. There are several generator waveforms available and you can also load arbitrary waveforms. When you do, the record length defaults to the length of the loaded file. I'll override that for now in this example. Reading rate is the number of readings per second which get posted to the graph. This only affects the graphic view, not the saved file. Note that in bench mode, the reading rate can be set higher, up to 250 readings per second. The next set of properties sets the bandwidth filtering, noise weighting, notch tuning, as well as the bandpass selectivity and tuning. You can choose to use the signal path settings or override them here. Now I'll enable Save to File and then click the File Settings button. This lets me assign the file name, location, format, and whether to replace or append new data if the file already exists. Note that you can also use variables for file name and location. If your signal path is set to a digital input, you'll have additional file format options in the pull-down menu to select from. The Advanced Settings button provides access to the generator output levels, analyzer input ranges, as well as the measurement bandwidth. To start recording, click the Start Measurement or Start Sequence button. Here are the results, and here is the saved WAV file. That's all for now. Be sure to look for other audio precision quick tips at ap.com and thanks for watching.